Welcome to the finale of Spider-Man the movie. Mary Jane is now on her way home. Finally, I got the groceries and everything, and now... <laughs> Look at that! Look at that face! That hair! <laughs> Well, at least, well, at least, unlike, well, at least, unlike the the movie, they actually explain how Mary kidnapped this time. Yeah. Although, well, so, okay, it would make more sense if Green Goblin knocked her out after that, because you know, yeah. Mary Jane was it. Mary Jane actually found herself asleep on top of a that that big bridge and. Mm -hmm. And and she was in her pajamas, so that's not yeah exactly yeah. It's like it was suggested how he captured her, but it, they never actually showed it, right? Yeah, yeah. how they yeah. did. Okay, I I even I mean, sorry. They showed um they showed uh like the Green Goblin making it to his aunt's house, but and yeah. and Mary Jane lived next door, so yeah, that might that so it's so yeah, it's implied, not so much um shown. Okay. But then again, it's not too important anyway, so... Uh, true. True. Now, this is another level th that I hate because, again, like the Breaking and Entering level, this is, a, this is another level that, that has never happened until now. It's like the Vulture level, except it's more difficult. It's, it's purely a chase, and he's leaving behind a bunch of, uh... And he's, is he occasionally going to blow up some more buildings like what Vulture did? No, thankfully so no. It's so just, it's just straight up a chase. Okay. Yes. Okay. But, That's good. But the, the challenge, quite as bad as the but the challenge is that he places bombs all over. Okay, so he's he's leaving a bunch more obstacles for you that you need exactly. to avoid. Exactly. But, but those obstacles look pathetically easy to. Uh, the, oh, well, then again, in between that, if you're up close to him, like you would naturally assume, those bombs will become a bigger problem. And he's weaving in between buildings, giving you very little room to uh, uh, maneuver around, assuming you're right up next to him, which is what you're going to naturally assume you need to do on your first playthrough of the stage. So, yeah. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Yeah, like right here in moments uh, like that where he's yeah, bobbing so around. Okay. You know, I'm just imagining throughout this sequence, the uh, freaking green oh, yeah. goblin is just going like, Spider-Man, Spider-Man. <laughs> Waning Spider-Man. Can't catch me? Because he's slow. He's an idiot because he's slow. Look out. Here comes Green Goblin. <laughs> Did you actually come up with that, Scott? Because that's yes. actually clever. Yes, I just did. Wow. Oh, that, was a, well, that, that was, was a awesome. level. Very that was two minutes. <laughs> so how long every level should have been. Yeah. And now we're up to the last level of the game. What was that? What was that? Like Sonic? Was the Sonic Forces two minutes? Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, yeah. Sonic Forces is level design. Oof. Like it, it wasn't that it was bad. It was just the level designs. Levels were just so short. Yeah. Just. Yeah. In fact, um, there was actually a video I saw explaining on how. Generation oh, it's the. Ch is this is this this iteration of the choose scene? Yeah, kind of. But 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 keep in mind. Uh, but keep this in mind. Batman Forever did it first. Mm. So, yeah, but Batman Forever was a it was a terrible movie. And so let's be, let's be real. And the first Spider Man was a good movie. Yes, it is. Speaking speaking of the choose scene, I, I want to talk about something. Like because I was a kid, I was a kid when I first saw that scene. So. Uh, 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 just as Green Goblin uh, drops Mary Jane, as well as the uh, the uh, the cable car or whatever that is, um, the one filled of Boy Scouts, yeah. all the kids, yes. <laughs> just, just just as he drops them, he says a, a choose, like he says, it's a choose or something like that. No, no, he, he goes now choose. <laughs> he goes now choose. And then he drops well, her. Well, well, let me tell you, when I first saw that scene. I first thought he was. I, I honestly first thought he was sneezing as he drops them. Choo, choo, and then he drops them. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. In all seriousness, that's kind of in character. <laughs> Let's see. I accidentally dropped it. I think I'm coming. I'm coming down with a cold, Spider-Man. Choo. <laughs> oh my God! I've never thought of that. We should, we should name this part Green Goblin's Cold. Yeah. <laughs> but now, like, Green Goblin's Cold. Green Goblin's Ill. 
I am the Shogun of Terror! Ah, cool! <laughs> I do! I love Samurai Jack. Oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait to meet. I cannot wait to meet Phil Lamar at Tommy Con. Holy crap! The the Green Goblin, the Green Goblin earlier just did re Hayabusa's throw technique from Ninja. Yeah. Ken. Oh my God. So, so you don't go after Green Goblin on the ground, which is still now, but uh, like same case. At, at, well, the same at first, first, same, second, first, same as the first, except this time, you have a much better place to move around in with the webs. So. I'm like, uh, where the hell? Where the hell is... Where's Goblin? And where's Goblin? Uh, I guess just... Like home. I think he's on his glider. He's on his glider. I know he's on his glider. Oh, he left the stove on! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! That's exactly what happened! I left the stove on! I'm out, Spidey. I accidentally left my oven on. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, we're having, too, we're having way too much fun making these jokes about the Green Goblin. Yeah, yeah. I think it's the Green Goblin voice because these are just trivial things. They're just so much more fun. Green to Goblin is all this personality. The Green Goblin yeah, in this. I, I I agree. The Green Goblin in this movie is much better than the one from Amazing Spider-Man. The, the, like honestly, like 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 this like the these movies had way more quotable villains and. And they were way more fun to watch, especially Green Goblin. Yeah, William Dafoe is the best Green Goblin. He it's also William Dafoe, so it's like he's already just this insanely fun I think uh, he, it, actor to watch when he goes over the top. I, so I think just I think like J.K. Simmons as Jonah. I think William Dafoe is the Green Goblin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But oh my god, <laughs> I love these movies are so awesome. I don't I don't really like. Oh, so three have, was terrible, but one and two were fantastic. Because Spider-Man and but, but Ven, uh, Venom, had, we had Venom. Yeah, three. Yeah, but their Venom was garbage. <laughs> it was Eric from that '70s show. Yeah, it was garbage. I honestly thought three was simply all right. I didn't think it was that bad. I mean, no. I agree it has plenty of problems. Don't get me wrong, but I still didn't think it was that bad. I thought. So, was, how about that dance number with Peter Parker? Uh, that, was, that, was, that, was, that scene was laughably bad. I didn't, yeah, yeah, but yeah, it was cringe. I freaking hated it. Emo Peter sucks. Because um, it was. Uh, oh, what the? Uh, oh, uh. <laughs> Tell me sorry, sorry, my foot fell asleep. <laughs> I have a glitch in my glider. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my. That's just gonna be. I feel like this, this should be the running gag for this commentary. Of all the things we, we could do to the Will and the Foes Green Goblin. <laughs> Sorry, I I just got off the phone with my IT guy. I'm scheduled for tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Anyway, going back to the topics of uh, Spider-Man movies. Um, which, which Spider-Man movie was the one with like the screaming Peter Parker? Uh, that was two. That was... Okay. That was the fin that was the uh, climax of two. I uh. you know I love Spider-Man two. Don't. Oh yeah, that was that was a fantastic movie. Because, fantastic. That's that's like cons that's considered to be the best of the uh, of the year uh, of the trilogy. And also, yeah. oh, one of the funniest scenes in in that movie was um J Jonah laughing at when when, P when Peter asked, um, "Can I get paid in advance?" <laughs> <laughs> you serious? <laughs> I love that line. Yes. I also yeah, like, like uh, pizza time. Pizza time. <laughs> You're late. I'm not paying for those. <laughs> pizza time <laughs> I also I love like, Spider-Man like, 2 was also the most memed one like there, remember that one meme where uh, like those kids were about to get run over by a car it looks and like Peter, Peter was about to do something, just something. <laughs> <laughs> and then they just eat a hot dog get some kids get run over by a bus and then like and then, the, and then like the one guy who's like having a piece of pizza and then right when he's about to eat it Spider-Man grabs the pizza with a web <laughs> pizza time <laughs> I just, love, I just also just love the way Tobey Maguire says that. He just he just casually says pizza, pizza time. <laughs> pizza time. <laughs> Go! <laughs> you guys are making me want to rewatch the Spider-Man trilogy. Yes, yeah. I have his I, I don't. I, I don't have those movies anymore, but I should probably consider rebuying them on Blu-ray. I, I saw this um, massive uh, collector's pack of Spider-Man movies where it was like um, Spider-Man 1, 2, Amazing Spider-Man 1 and 2. Oh, and Spider-Man 3. 
I have all three of the Raimi Spider-Man movies on DVD. Mm. I used to have the first one, but it doesn't. But disc one stopped reading for some yeah. baffling reason. Oh, ow! <laughs> Stop hurting me, Norman. Mine just simply stopped working. Don't, don't worry, Spidey. I want. I want you to be ill like me. There we ah, go. Crap. Ah, crap. I'm out of eggs again. I need to. I need those to make more. <laughs> I need those to make my delicious, <laughs> this homemade omelets. <laughs> a secret recipe. Oh. Here, I'll treat you to some later. Oh, no. Oh, oh God. Oh, what, what happened? What happened? That... Oh, what happened to your model? Oh, what well, uh... Uh, for some reason, I was having a dream about wanting to make an omelet. Don't know how exactly that happened, but okay. Oh, this is how the. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was clever. Oh. <laughs> There's more. There's more. Don't. T let me guess. These Don't tell Harry. Closed. They're still open. Don't tell Harry. Don't tell Harry. Yep. <laughs> yep. I was expecting. Don't tell. What, what? What? Why? 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 He's just. Oh, here's what, he, over, here's, what he act, here's what he actually said. Here's what he actually said. Tell Harry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, I see. But yeah, I did add in the uh, Peter. Don't tell Harry. <laughs> don't tell Harry. <laughs> I even. Mean, are, are, are you kidding? Wait, did, did, Will? Did you just give him an Arnold Schwarzenegger impression voice? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, this is the scene. Um. And again, these in-game costumes, they do apply to, um... The Just kissing characters. him through the mask. <laughs> so at some point, you can have Mary Jane kissing the goblin? <laughs> oh, oh my god. God, no! Well, just the dead goblin is just slain on the floor. <laughs> and that... So that was Spider-Man the movie. Uh, final thoughts. Um, I actually do like this game. There are a few moments in the game that aren't really that, you know, good by any means. I don't like the Oscorp levels by any means. Me um, but I will say, hearing Tobey Maguire and Willem Dafoe and Horace Bruce Campbell in, from the movie in this game, it's amazing. Um, it's especially Willem Dafoe as the Green <laughs> Goblin. It is amazing. The, the best part of the movie, the best part of the original movie. Yes. The the <laughs> but um, I love how like like s some of the uh, some of the aspects of the movie were were ac some of the, some of the movie moments were actually perfectly emulated in the game. I love seeing them in the game, like the like, like the playing the moments from the yeah. It's it's amazing the, the way you see that. The music is pretty good. Yeah, some of it was the music was pretty good. The character design is amazing. I recommend you play this game. Just, I recommend just play this game. It is amazing. It's worth a shot. It, it's, it's worth. worth a shot yeah, it's it's worth a playthrough. All right. So, uh, Seth, what do you think? Final thoughts. First of all, I want to know what and what song am I hearing right now? Oh. I don't know. I don't uh, know. The early 2000s. That's what you're listening to. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, uh, okay. Seth, final thoughts? Okay. Well, as I said, Spider-Man, oh, Spider-Man, Spider-Man does whatever a spider can. Um, <laughs> I, this is, Spider-Man's definitely one of my favorite Marvel superheroes and superheroes in general. Um, uh, as I said, the, the first movie was my, was my very first superhero film. And I, I remember being, I remember seeing the, the video game like being advertised on disc two of the DVD. And I was like, oh man, I want to play this because it's Spider-Man and it's a Spider-Man video game and I get to swing webs and just like the movie. And ah, basically the same reason why I was as ecstatic over the Star Wars episode three video game. And, but uh, unlike the Star Wars episode three video game in which it was everything I've ever hoped for, this video game was actually very lacking for me because um. I mean, I love the combat, and the level design isn't too bad for the most part, but, oh boy. I, as I agree with Lucas, the Oscorp levels are terrible, easily the worst part of the game, especially, and I mean especially, Chemical Chaos. I still hate that level, I'm sorry. And, uh, but, I, but as I said, but again, I do like the, 
Oh, how are you? I, I just wait. I just repeated myself. Um, <laughs> the the combat is easily the best part of the game. The voice acting is passable. I mean, Spider Man sounds good. Os Oscorp slash Smash Green Goblin sounds good. Bruce Campbell, of course, sounds good. But everyone else is pretty laughably bad and sometimes annoying to, because you know the, the 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 goons like the the mooks. They sound just as quotable as say. The ones from the Star Wars Jedi Knight games, if you if you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. The Jedi Academy, to be more specific, because, you know, oh, come get me, Jedi. I thought Jedi were powerful. Looks like the freak wants to play. Yeah. 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 That, that's what kind of quotable. So, oh. yeah, the first, the first Spider-Man movie video game, I think, is all right so far. It's not terrible, but it's nothing great. Honestly, I have a feeling that Spider-Man 2 is a miles better game than this one and also, I haven't played that one yet but I still want to so also also did, also did you know that also did you know that the uh, that the, at the company that the company that did the cutscenes for for Shadow the Hedgehog also did the uh, cutscenes for this well no wonder they look so pretty meh then because they're just <laughs> as bland <laughs> well, so, Shadow the Hedgehog like the studio that did the cutscenes yeah blur the yeah blur that's a, that's a company wow they gotten a lot better since this game <laughs> So anyway, uh, Will, final thoughts of this game? Um, Spider Man. Yeah, Spider Man. <laughs> it, it's uh, it's it's cool, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I it's been forever since I played this game, so like, I don't know, like, um, I mean, uh, I could definitely see the game definitely starting to plummet in terms of quality as the game goes on. Yeah. Like confusing uh, difficulty for, uh, uh, or, confu or more, excuse me, confusing um, like uh, like uh, cheap moves for difficulty, and yeah. but like when it comes to um, from what I've seen, eh, maybe I should give it another shot. But um, well, Spider Man being my favorite uh, Marvel hero, I've definitely been <laughs> been known to uh judge his uh his appearances in just about anything extremely like to a extreme level so i don't know I, uh, it's it looks pretty good though i all right so I, that's all i have to say I, I i i'm sorry it's been forever since i played right. this game that's so funny. Yeah, i thought you were i thought you were gonna be a bit more negative because you know you were being very negative earlier in part two with like all yeah. this blood warehouse level is so boring so yeah. you have more to say about that yeah, not really. All right. I, so, Scott, first question: um, Have you played this game before? No, I haven't. All right. Okay. So, so are you? So, would you be okay. interested in playing this game at some point? Uh, I will probably just skip this one. <laughs> yeah, you're not really missing anything, Scott. Honest, I haven't really played any good Spider-Man games yet. Um, although I do want to, I still want to play Spider-Man Two, but I'll just have to wait for another time before yeah. we get to that. Yeah, so, so yeah, that was Spider-Man, the movie, video the game, game. The game, yes. Um, a, a, Wait, did a, you just say Spider-Man, the movie, the video game, the game? Like, <laughs> Ivan Ooze. <laughs> so, anyway, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that was, yeah, featuring Dante from Devil May Cry. <laughs> so, anyway, yeah, that was, that was Spider-Man, the movie, the game, and, uh, we hope you all enjoyed the commentary. So thank you all so much for watching. Have yourselves a fantastic night and take care and be gamers. And for, all of, you that, and for all of those out there, hope to see you next time on your next gaming adventure. Ha, we spoke, we, we switched um, ending quotes. This yes, time. thank you. So you're welcome. Have well, a good night, everyone. All right. We'll see good you night, then. Everybody. <laughs>